a significant numbers of Anglicans have entered into visible communion with the Roman Catholic Church. There have been times when that number has been large, times when it's been small. Times when it's been the effect of a particular crisis in the life of the Anglican Church, and times when it hasn't. And I don't see this as, in that sense, anything new. The Roman Catholic Church has responded over that period in rather diverse ways, um, but it, it would not occur to me to see this as, as an act of aggression, a statement of no confidence, precisely because the routine relationships that we enjoy as churches continue. I think, if I may, a, a, a nice analogy is, is to remember that the churches the ch and the churches together, they're organic. They're not static. And they grow. And like any tree or plant, they grow at the edges. You know, a, a, a tree grows with additional re reach through its branches. And in a sense, we're, we're, we're here on an edge. We don't quite know where this will go, clearly. But we're confident together. Uh, that it's, it can help people to be uh, attached 